What's up? My name is Alan with Alan Plays, and this is one of my best buddies here, Brian McKinney. And um, we decided to do a fun series together. He has a Raspberry Pi that you've loaded how many games on? Uh, 13,000 uh, plus games. Damn. That's a lot of games. So we have a plethora of games to choose from on this system. And we thought it might be fun to kind of like go through four or five of them. You know, maybe, you know, each week, I don't know, every day. We'll see how it goes. And uh, talk about them, play them, um, see if they're any good, just see what's going on with them. So, without further ado, I think one of the first games we were going to jump into is Punch-Out. Punch-Out, a classic. You might as well start with something familiar before we get uh, too off into the weeds. So we just have it paired here. The Retro Pie is kind of down on the floor. Yeah. So it's got arcade games, it's got uh, all the consoles, including uh, PC games. So it's got uh, Atari 2600, 5700, and 7800 to Sega, Sega Master System, Sega CD, yeah. the whole nine. So it's literally got everything loaded in. Which one's uh, start on this controller? Uh, this one right here. Okay. Get that work. Okay. I'm hoping the game audio compared to the our audio is okay. We'll test that out on this video. You let us know. <laughs> yeah, when I first got my Nintendo, I was just like blown away by the graphics and everything. I think this was like one of my first games too. Oh yeah. It was like maybe the fourth one I got. I don't think I ever played this all the way through either. I'm trying to remember. I haven't played this in quite a long time. I dabbled in it when you, you came by with this yeah. last time, but it's weird, too, like, getting acclimated with this controller. Yeah, I wanted to get another uh, old-school controller. That way it would be, like, the real deal, but... This controller always seemed to be working perfect, so... Do it. Do it, boy. <laughs> yeah, I think last time we dabbled in it, we got stuck on a bald bull. Yeah. It's funny how this game isn't even a boxing game, it's just a puzzle game. Yeah, all about timing, and uh, that's pretty much about it. Learning patterns. Oh, yeah, we're drinking on some, some Bloody Marys. And they always put Mario in these things. Alright, you're up. Alright, let's see what's going on. Yeah. Alright, some fun. This is like pre hipster mustache era. Oh, uh, yeah. Terrible. Nope. You gotta go for that face. There you go. That's what I was like waiting for the whole time. I was like... You gotta hit start to use it. There it is, yeah. <laughs> I lost it too. <laughs> That's right. Oh yeah, because he takes it if you get the hit. There you go. Got her back. You don't even need. There you go. Get him. <laughs> it's weird how when they they ran out, they, their license ran out, and they had to put Dream in there or whatever. Yeah. As opposed to Mike Tyson. Something like that. Have you seen Mike Tyson play this? No. He'll play it every once in a while, like on a talk show or something. He's terrible at it, of course. You know. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think he would be really good at video games. Just kicking people's ass in real life. Yeah, he doesn't need this. No. <laughs> and he's down for good. Alright. That was Brian's performance. Yeah, that was that was pretty bad. That was not at bad. The beginning. No. I'm just letting him know who's just... who's playing with. Getting slapped around at the beginning. 
little bit. I wonder if I can turn this up a little bit without messing up. This is all like flying by the seat of our pants. This guy always reminded me of uh, the dude from Street Fighter, E Honda. Oh yeah. There's got to be some sort of crossover with this. They're cousins. Oh, son. Yeah, I think you get those stars when they start flashing like that, right? Yeah. If you hit them right as the star comes up. There it is. Oh, I try to, I try to, oh, I try to be cool. <laughs> I try to be cool. Oh, son, help. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, that's good. I'll just blame it on all this equipment in front of the screen. That's what it is. It's the camera, it's the mic, it's the wind. It's too yeah. hot. I'm meant to do that. You're awesome. <laughs> you gotta watch those eyebrows. Just like real life. You gotta shave those eyebrows. Gotta shave those eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you can, like, switch it up and go left, right. It's crazy that Mario's in this as a referee. Yeah, they always, like, try and fit him in somewhere. Try to squeeze him in. I think it's stunning. Yeah. Good job, Brian. Yeah, I couldn't remember which way it was going. All right, should we switch to another game? Yeah. I think it's where yeah, it is. for sure. Yeah, Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, a classic. You you knew you knew people out there may not know this title, but it's uh it's a good one. Let's try it out. Yeah, so we got arcades, we got Neo Geo, the Ataris, uh ColecoVision, all those regular Nintendo, Super Nintendo, sixty four. All these. Who would be a good one to throw on? Something that something rare. Hmm. Man. Some Bonk's Adventure, probably. Oh, I remember this. All right, let's try it out. All right, you, you play. I want to see. I haven't seen this. Yeah, it's kind of like Mario, but you just hit him with your head. Oh, okay. So it's... Bonk's Adventure. When did this come out? Oh, man. This was like right when Genesis came out, mm -hmm. and the the consoles like came out at the same time. So it was just like you had to choose which side you were gonna go on. But we went with uh, the Genesis so we could have uh, Altered Beast. So let's see how it goes. Like, like oh, you and you and Russ got uh, yeah. Russ is so Brian's that's brother. That's how you it. So here we go. Let's try it again. So there we go. I'm looking it up. It looks like it came out in the 90s. There's different releases for it, though. Yeah, there was... 1990, the... I think. That's interesting. Yeah, the graphics and the gameplay is pretty simple. Not much to it so far. This is just the first level. I mean, at this time, though, these graphics were probably phenomenal. Oh, yeah. The colors and everything were... Yeah. It was doing a lot. I feel like I remember renting this when I was a kid. We had a Topson video. Remember that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we used to go over there. Stuff. It was, like, right down the street in our old neighborhood. We used to go over there and rent stuff. And you know exactly where the games were, too. Mm. Like... <laughs> Just a beeline for it. Not doing good. Alright. Not bad. Wanna try the next one? Yeah, I'll try this one. And see what's see what's happening with it. Alright. Bonk? That's how you bonk. Yeah. That's how you jump. Is that it? Is that all you have? Yeah, bonk jump, and jump and then bonk, yeah. That's, that's all you really need in life. Okay, and you can come down head first. 
we want that for life, I'm assuming? That I'm not Damn, sure. he's biting the, the thing. <laughs> yeah, he's got to climb. He's got to hold that head up somehow. Okay, so you get the watermelon. Huh. Son? <laughs> so don't make me slap you in my head. Damn, I only got one heart left. Give me that. What? Oh, I'm super bonked now. Yeah, fuck volcanoes, dude. <laughs> <laughs> volcanoes don't even hurt you anymore. Damn, it's gonna happen again. On a smaller scale. Plus, it give you like super jump or something. I think it did. Seems like it. I can't tell if that's like lava right there, or is that just rock? It's yeah, I think it's just rock. Oh, okay. Dude, he's he's out of his mind. Look at him, he's tripping. Yeah, he's like super pissed off. Yeah, he's had enough. He's out of his bonking mind. Get up there. <laughs> All right, he's like cooling off now. Yeah, settling down. Oh, sir. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see if you can oh, I jump see. with that. I don't even know what that does, but I want it. Alright, you're up, B. Alright, let's see what's going on. I know, like, they have, like, a little scoreboard down there, but... Yeah, there's nothing else. Oh, there's 17, no... 10. Oh. Yeah, what is it tracking? Never mind, I couldn't even see the... I couldn't even see my health or whatever, because the camera was on the way. I was like, what is... Let's see what's going on here. Oh, I guess sad. we can't touch those. You can't down. touch nothing, dude. We're back. <laughs> He just passed out. Yeah, he was just like, I give up. He's like, He's like I, don't want, I don't want to do it anymore. Ooh, no. look, look at those little weird things. Oh, okay, so you get you get your little fruit. The dinosaur's wearing a hat. That's cute. Can I get this? Is that... Jump on top, yeah. I killed him. So what are we supposed to do? Hey! Wake up the dinosaur. Oh, he got him up. Yeah. Now you gotta go in his mouth, I bet. Now he's crying. <laughs> and now he's crying. <laughs> okay, cool. We're inside the belly of the beast. You're I'm swimming in frickin' Tapatio, dude. Am I supposed to be... Yeah. I think I'm supposed to... No. What am I... It doesn't appear to be hurting you to go in there. It's just... Just the little throat things. Well, hey, that's a uh, that's bonks. That's bonks. <laughs> so we knocked out first a couple of them. We, you know, we did a classic Mike Tyson's Punch Out, and we were able to get into. Uh, we can do some Neo Geo. Let's do Neo Geo in the next one, but uh, yeah. So hey, Mike Tyson's Punch Out, uh, bonk on our first episode of Retro Pie with Brian McKinney. Well, thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you <laughs> on the next one. Cool.